Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome to um, lesson three, this is, of learning the Arabic alphabet. So, so far we've covered these four letters. We've talked about the sound when you have the fatha on them, which is a, ba, ta, tha. We've talked about the kasra sound where there's a, a little line under each letter, which gives it the sound of e, b, d, and th. And today we're going to be talking about the third and final sound that's produced with the vowels. And that is with this symbol. Okay, so this symbol, which looks like a, a golf club that's upside down. Uh, this symbol above each letter. Okay, so with this symbol, you pronounce it as U, U. Okay, U. Bu, bu, tu. Remember this, this uh, boat with the two dots look like a teeth. So tu, and thu the three dots. Thu, u, bu, tu, thu. Okay, so let's have a go at merging a few of the letters together. Then, so let's say we have. Um, Okay, let's say we have this. So let's say it's two dots there. It's going to be this one here. And let's say there's okay, and one dot there. All right. So um, two, so, bu, two, so, bu. Okay, let's remove those. Okay, and let's remove the symbols as well. Let's try a new combination. So let's try. Okay, this, how would we pronounce this? We'd say. Tu, bu, tu. Tu, bu, and tu. Tu, bu, tu. Okay, let's have a go at merging what we've learned so far in the past three lessons. So, this time we have, let's say, that symbol there. We have this symbol here. And we have this symbol here. Okay, so how are we going to pronounce these? So, this is going to be ta. This one's going to be b. And this one's going to be tu. Ta, b, tu. Ta, b, tu. So, ta, b, tu. Okay, let's have um, another go. And this time, let's try another combination. So, okay, let's try this. So, this would be T, B, 2. T, B, 2. T, B, 2. Okay, let's try another combination then. And this time, let's change a few of the letters as well. So let's try this. This is a three one, remember? This is single dot underneath. And okay, let's have a go at this. So tha bu i. Tha bu i. So in this lesson we've learned about this symbol here and the sound that this vowel gives. This is actually known as a dhamma. dhamma. Again, it's not necessary to learn the terms. However, the concept is very important. So, this letter here can be pronounced in three ways. If it has a fatha, we say a, kasra, i, dhamma, u. A, i, u. Ba, bi, bu. Ta, ti, tu, tha, fi, thu. Hope that makes sense. If you have any comments, any suggestions, please leave them in the comments below and subscribe to the channel. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.